The Ejercito de Tierra Spain's army has officially confirmed the acquisition of 4,500 Peugeot Landtrek vehicles as part of its VMTT, Vehiculo Milita Todo Torino Tactico, program. This landmark contract, valued at 217 million euros, will unfold over four years and represents a significant step in the modernization of the Spanish Army's vehicle fleet. The new Landtreks are set to replace the PS10 Anibal, a vehicle that has been in service since 2004 but has never fully met the Army's expectations. The competition for this contract was between two contenders, Ituri representing the Peugeot Landtrek and TSD, which proposed the Ford Ranger. In March 2024 the Army's Logistics Support Command Mail expressed its preference for the Landtrek, a decision that was contested by TSD. Following a legal appeal from TSD challenging the procurement process, a Spanish court ultimately rejected the appeal, enabling Mail to proceed with the contract confirmation. While some observers might find the selection of the Peugeot Landtrek surprising, given its basis on the Kaixin F70, a pickup truck designed by Chinese manufacturer Chang'an Automobile, Spanish authorities were persuaded by the vehicle's performance and suitability for the Army's specific requirements. It is crucial to note that these vehicles are intended for non-combat roles. The Spanish Ministry of Defense clarified that they will be used for tactical tasks removed from combat-related activities, including liaison missions within the national territory. In addition to the Ejercito de Tierra, other branches of the Spanish Armed Forces will also receive the Landtrek, including the Guardia Civil, the Ejercito del Air y del Espacio, and the Armada Española. This acquisition is part of a broader initiative to modernize unprotected military vehicles across Spain's defense apparatus. The Peugeot Landtrek is a versatile mid-size pickup truck engineered for various terrains and tasks, available in both 4x2 and 4x4 drive configurations. It comes equipped with two engine options, a 1.9L turbo diesel engine producing 150 horsepower and 350 newton meters of torque, and a 2.4L turbocharged petrol engine delivering 210 horsepower and 320 newton meters of torque. Depending on the model, these engines can be paired with either a six-speed manual or automatic transmission. Built for durability, the Landtrek is capable of handling heavy-duty tasks, with a payload capacity exceeding 1 ton and a towing capacity of up to 3 tons. Its off-road capabilities are enhanced by features like hill descent control and a rear differential lock, making it adept for rough terrains. The ground clearance ranges from 214 mm to 235 mm, ensuring excellent performance in off-road conditions. The procurement of military vehicles often brings to light complex issues involving performance, cost and national interests. This situation mirrors similar debates in other countries. For instance, in 2015, the French Ministry of Defense faced criticism after announcing the acquisition of Ford Rangers to replace Peugeot P4S, sparking protests over prioritizing non-French brands over domestic manufacturers like Renault or Citroën. In Spain, the choice of the Peugeot Landtrek, despite its partial Chinese origins, reflects the urgency of modernizing the Army's fleet of off-road vehicles while adhering to strict budgetary constraints. This decision illustrates the balance between fulfilling operational needs and supporting national industry. The acquisition of 4,500 Peugeot Landtrek vehicles is part of a larger initiative to enhance Spain's military capabilities, addressing current operational requirements while anticipating future challenges. As the Spanish Army continues to modernize its fleet, the Landtrek's versatile performance and reliability will contribute significantly to the effectiveness of tactical operations across various branches of the armed forces. This strategic move not only strengthens Spain's defense posture but also showcases the complexities and considerations inherent in military procurement decisions.